Folks, we're here for the Sonic. We're on the internet. Are we? I don't know why I do this myself. I was up late last night. Thought it would be a good idea after a podcast to relax with a couple beers and uh, do my uh, Fort Nightmare quest. Have you done the Fort Nightmares, Grub? Uh, no, because I, I, I've been playing other games for uh, for work and stuff. So oh, Okay, it's no. Not. It's, it's no, well, kind of. You go to these like weird, you can become a werewolf. So it's like Sonic Unleashed. But uh, there's a thing. Last night's quest was you have to beat this boss in the basement of this house. But everyone goes there now, and so you just get killed immediately. So I tried it like fucking 20 times, and next thing you know, it's 4 something in the morning. And uh, oh, no. Bonk actually thought oh. I fell asleep in my chair. She came in here at like 4 in the morning. He's like, I need to wake Dan up. So he comes to the bed. And he's like, nope, I was just wrapping up my Fortnite thing. So I'm hungover, I'm sleep deprived, and I got to play this motherfucking game. So That's what, that's what partners are for. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Many a time. <laughs> yes. Jesus Christ. So now, oh, and it's this shit. I did this. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Right. Do I just go yes, right yes, to the bird. eagle? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> All right. I'm All right. Do my let's do it. While we're here. Majestic. Carry me, eagle. Okay. Well, at least I've done this before, so I'll know where I'm going, right? Well, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> Folks at home, can you hear? Can you see? Is everything working? I can oh. definitely see. I'm not listening to the that, so we'll see what the chat has to say. Grub, I was in a meeting with you early this morning, and your yes. setup down there is gets very dark. Yeah, it was like uh, light outside, are, but it was very cavernous in your setup there. There are two of those rectangle small basement windows on the other side of the basement way over there, and that's the only place for natural light. So if I turn off all the lights, it does get very dark down here. Nice. Is, is it like a, a movie room down there? Is that where you watch the movies? Uh, the, the, the other room has uh, the projector and stuff, yeah. Uh, oh, and, nice. and so even during, it, the sun is on the other side of the house, so it's all indirect light. So even during the day, you can we can have the projector going, and that, that is nice. The kids really oh, like sweet. that. Oh, sweet. Nice. Yeah. I've thought about going into the projector life, but it seems like there's some stuff you got to look up. Yeah, you just want to make sure you get one that's, you know, bright enough for whatever setting you're doing. And um, I, I have a 1080p one, and I'm totally okay with that. It, it works fine, but a lot of people are going 4K now and short and throw, and I have one that's just like a tra traditional, we put it in the back time. of the room and Let's stuff. The, the biggest right issue is, is figuring out how you're going to connect sound so you can make sure you have, like, a good speaker system and stuff. I, I'm doing it through a pretty low latency Bluetooth, and it works for me, it, but uh, it's not going to work for everybody. Sound is the biggest I pain know. in the ass. Yeah. yeah. My my dad used to work at like a TV repair store, and also used to do Ooh. projectors as his job. Uh, one of the stories I have is, you know, he set up you know, Eddie Murphy's projector and stuff oh, like that. Right. But like, I grew up with projectors, and I didn't think it was that weird until like I started inviting kids over from school. <laughs> brought into the basement where we had basically just like a wall painted white surrounded by speakers like set into the wall and it was like a seven foot tall screen and i was like here's the tv and they were like what yeah that's, that's luxurious projectors weren't, projectors weren't big back then i didn't because i was a, around them so much i didn't think this was luxurious at all because it was just like you know my dad's a blue collar guy but this happened to be his work <laughs> Oh, sorry. I thought I was going to die. Some dumb bullshit. Close one. Um, Close one. Okay. Um, was the picture quality good on it or like... Oh, shit. Okay. Um, by today's standards, no. Um, oh, I thought you missed that. Holy I God, don't... That okay. I, this is all coming back oh, to me real quick. Okay. That sorry. That scared the hell out of me. <laughs> um, no, picture quality back then was not good. I mean, this was one of those... like the, the first one we had was one of the really old ones that had a blue light, a green light, and a... And a uh, whatever, cyan or a red light. And yeah, like all right. of them projected an image at the third point. Yes. So it was kind of not great, but like it was like it must have been from like the 80s or something. It was really old. Yeah, for the a while uh, there. big screen TV we got as a kid was a rear projection TV. Fuck! Fuck! And oh it's wait, okay. there's a ground was... down there. Ground right. down oh my! There. And you did that every time. The I last know. Time too. Yeah, every uh, time. It's not like me to forget something. No, yeah, no, this isn't. is really. No. What the fuck is this? What is this? Yeah, this is weird. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, uh, uh, after a few years, the rear projection TV, the, those three lights would get out of alignment. And you or the, the, the bulbs red. burn out, too. Like, that sucks yeah, too. Or the oh, bulbs yeah, burn the out. Bulbs. But you have yeah. the red picture and the green picture, oh. like, all in different directions or whatever. We're off to a rocky start here. <laughs> yeah, what's happening here? Do I. Is this good? No, it's okay. It's okay. No, okay. you're not shooting it. Is it okay? okay? Wow, it is okay. 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 Uh, it's usually not okay. I mean, listen, it's not okay. Okay, so I do it's this. It's still Sonic 06. I do this. Okay, yeah. we're live. And then I do that. Then that? Yes. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. And there then that? Go. Oh, Jesus. Do I, I don't need know to... why they, like, I mean, I know the what? game. What? What's happening? Like, oh, Fuck! Oh, okay. Sorry. Oh, do, do, do. 
that's a oh. whole new uh, that's a whole new reaction uh, that I had there. Oh, do 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 do. Normal. Where did I? Where was I fucking up last time here? Well, uh, Silver the Hedgehog. <laughs> oh, I forgot oh, yeah. how to control Silver. What is this going I, so I've well. said it before, and I'll say it probably every time. I don't know. I know this game is not completely finished, but I don't know what sadistic motherfucker laid out the levels this way. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the, the obviously the camera person. The, person the camera, camera person, Lakitu, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah Lakitu. <laughs> Lakitu never talked to the man designing the levels. Like, it's like yeah. Lakitu, but he's like kind of phoning it in today. He's like yeah. thinking of quitting his job right. yeah. after like, this. He, like, he, he got fired from the Mario 64 for drinking on the job, and <laughs> yes. now he's... Yeah. They, they, the Sonic <laughs> doesn't care. They're like, yeah, we just need someone, so... How are there not more games that do the Lakitu thing where they make in canon the camera part of the, like, well, it's, there's like a character? Well, the thing with Lakitu was that, like, nobody, I, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, Grub, nobody, like, understood what a free camera was before, so they made it a character so that people That's were like, exactly. oh, he's like a little guy that I can control too, you know? Right, they're trying to, te they're trying to teach you that you are honestly controlling two characters right now. The camera is its own character, and yeah. Mar Mario 64 just made that like part of the thing but there's a there's a problem with that dan if you do that guess what you get what's that inverted ca camera inver inverted oh, camera controls yeah if you, if you want to look left you have to tell lakitu to move to the right that's true and then, I... now you're looking now you're looking left and so I... people don't like that and that's why you don't get uh, uh the camera is not its own person I do think that Mario 64 has aged kind of remarkably well for how old it is and I how know. it was like the first, you know, it, that. It's a, it's a genius game, yes. Yeah, but it's um, like the camera is the one thing I think it's like, okay, wait, wait, am I doing, is this right? I feel like yeah, I died no, here a lot. yes, but I want to, you know, just to prevent you from future grief, and I did mention this last time, but it didn't really, you know, happen. I'm listening. You can feather, fully. you can feather, thank you so much. You can feather this bitch to go real far. Like, Fe feather the... Ooh. Look at that. You can, yeah, like you can feather the hell out of this psychic jump and okay. you can go way, way farther and have way less close calls. Oh, so we're, we're getting stressed. All right. Look at that. <laughs> thank you. Thank oh, you. Thank you. Hell yeah. Okay. <laughs> Listen. Okay. <laughs> you learn something every day. I think we all owe each other an apology for last week. I don't know. No, <laughs> no. It's this game that does this to us. The, the game uh, did this to us. Yeah, yes. I totally and people not understanding apology. what makes a mainline Mario game, but mostly the game. I, yes, I talked about yeah. Mario way too much. <laughs> I do not deserve an apology. That is my life is talking about Mario too much. Yes, exactly. Uh, but yeah, okay. the, the game wants to sow discord and tear us apart. Yes, so we can't let it, it win. Succeed what am I doing here? Gotta, what's what's, we, what's we the deal here? Okay, so wait, I do this. I grab the I assume missiles. I got to kill those guys. Yeah, with their missiles. Okay. Look, I'm being like... That. Fastidious? Yeah. Is that the word? Yeah, meticulous Have I even. Been here? Have I been here? Fastidious. <laughs> no, I don't think you've been here because oh I God. think you've always just been like, fuck these guys. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> that doesn't sound like me. <laughs> ah. <laughs> okay, what am I doing? What? Wow. Oh, is that a thing? I okay. Mean, he used fastidious very correctly. I don't know if he said it right, but he used it correctly. <laughs> Thank you. I'm pretty, yeah. I'm pretty good with words. Yeah, I'm like surprised when I get a word right. That's like one of those fastidious words. Uh, yeah, I'm like, oh wow, I get that right. All right. I'm better at spelling than I am at like. Yeah, why are they dropping talking? spiky sure. balls on you? Come on. Okay, wait, wait, here we go. Here like we go. this isn't annoying enough. Just drop spike balls on them. Uh huh. I don't, yeah, the game never. Uh, people make this game never ask that question. Is this annoying enough? <laughs> yeah. that, but nope. We can always make it more annoying. You're gonna shoot something at me, right? Can I grab your hand? No. Nope. I don't know okay. if you can grab his hand. You yeah, this, be able it's to. some bullshit last time, right? Oh, his core's exposed. You want to hit close that? Close to him, something dumb's gonna happen. I'll just, I'll just throw shit. Okay. <laughs> his wow, legs like crossed over and yeah. popped off him. Something should happen. Thank you, Sonic. <laughs> we don't know what. We made the game. Oh, is that timed? This better not be timed. It's not timed. It just okay, stays I, there. Okay, I can just. You can feather okay. it. Okay, God, I can just take my time just here? The, just the right height. I can just take my time. I think so, yeah. Fastidious is the word of the day. Mm. Ooh, I'm, gonna, I'm even going to get this. like a little, little sound effect for that. Extra, extra grab. Okay. Throw, throw. Grab, throw, throw. You're getting it. You're getting it. Give me those. Oh, is jump juice <laughs> the same as grab juice? It is, yes. It's just oh. like power. It's like power. Oh, okay. Oh, I can't grab bullets. Give me missiles. Ah! 
<laughs> Shit. Okay, okay. Give me a box. Give me a box. Give me a thing. Fuck you. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Mike okay. says this game does not deserve this soundtrack. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a, it got pretty good. I, I, oh, I thought that was a thing with Sonic. The, the better the music, the worse the game. But apparently people say that's not true. Uh, no, it doesn't always track. Yeah, it doesn't okay. always track, apparently. Give me a missile. Yeah. Just okay. Yes. Like nice. Oh, shit. Oh, jeez. I just, the camera thing really <laughs> is... Have I mentioned that that's an issue? Because it's probably more of an issue than I'm letting on. What's wrong with it? Seems like I, I listen. I can see silver. What else do you need to see? Ah! But when I turn around <laughs> to grab the boxes, it's just you can't tell where you're throwing them. Okay. Can I, can I keep doing it? And okay. like, what are you supposed to do? Have faith the game's gonna <laughs> do the yeah, right thing you wanted man, to do? It really like, nah. just looks so gross to control, Dan. It, it it's looks really like unpleasant. I, yeah. And like, okay. what a oh. bad pitch it's at too. Like. Uh huh. I really <laughs> want to see an end of level. Okay, thing. remember this is where you died last time. Okay, why? What happened? Why? I don't know why. So let's like wait a okay. second and see what's happening here. So I think like some part of this oh, yeah. like crumbled underneath exercises. you. Okay. Remember like some part crumbled underneath you and you fell down. Yeah. I'm and we off. didn't know why and that was your last life. So this from here on out is the furthest you've gotten in Sonic okay. 06. I'm sweaty. I'm taking the jacket off. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> I did the thing, so something should have happened. I can't, by the mm -hmm. way, the camera, you just can't control the camera here. For, no, inexplicably. Yeah. I can't see where I'm going. Okay, now I have control for some reason. Okay. Oh, this is, oh, it fell, right? Didn't these fall? Yeah. So it I need like to go fast. fell or something. Maybe. I'm just gonna or maybe the next do section this. fell. Okay. I, I don't think you gotta go fast in this game. What the fuck? What? Okay, hey, oh not bad. Okay, now I'm just Sonic. Whew, my hands are like vibrating. Did I beat it? Oh, Were you really that close to the end? That's tragic. <laughs> no. Oh my god. Wait, we don't know if it's the end yet. We don't know if it's the end, oh, right? It was it was a later staircase, the chat says. Okay. Oh good, good. So I've still got that. Oh coming. good. More Excellent. Staircase. Okay, great. I, I I love that the, this level looks so plain and so boring that I yes. could not even tell it was a different area. I think we're near the end of the game. <laughs> I don't know. I said eighty one percent and I've done at least this is alive. Yeah. Oh God. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. This. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh. Okay. What's this? Those enemies seem to be protecting the door for some reason. Yeah, I know. This is how all the doors are working in this world. For some reason. <laughs> yes. For Something some will reason, happen. They're programmed by Doctor Robotnik to do bad guy things. Weird. <laughs> you guys ever have it when the weather changes and your door straight up won't open anymore? Yeah. The the. Oh shit, what the fuck? I don't know. Oh, hell out of me. Yeah, I mean, the, uh, yeah, yeah, like the, 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 the wood kind of. Yeah, warps. Yeah. Yeah, we straight up can't open our front doors. We gotta get, like, a locksmith out here so we can leave our house. <laughs> it wasn't the lock's problem, was it? Oh shit! Oh, um. Ooh, yeah, ooh, yeah, ooh. well, it's. Yeah, the lock gets funky too. The whole the thing's funky. could up. also expand. Yeah, I mean, the metal is. Oh, well, could. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I didn't yeah. know that was, like, a locksmith sort of job. I think of them more as, like, lock pickers than, like. Oh, yeah? I don't know. Lock unexpander. You know, they, they, I, I, I think I would make that same assumption, but now I think about it, they probably just understand yeah. how it works enough that they know how to fix those situations. Yeah, yeah we just yeah, want yeah. a whole like new else, handle thingy on call. there. What's going on? Why is there no? I don't. Oh, okay. Is this oh, what okay. fell? Oh, it's it falling. It's falling. It's falling. It's yeah. falling. Is it still falling? Am I cool? Maybe you're Am cool. I cool. Okay. Um, <laughs> what you're do very I... cool, Dan. Thank you. What is that a thing I can dash? Oh fuck! Wait, no, no, no! Don't, don't, don't! So I think don't you came dash from that, that way. You came from that way. I did. No, but I went. Yeah. Oh. Kill these guys. Kill these okay. guys. Oh, there's Maybe a door. Happened. There's, there's a, a door. different door. Ooh. God, this is so disorienting. Like why? Yes. Why yes. would you let us go back up to where we came from? Yeah, that's confusing. Okay, now this door, and then that does a thing. All right. All right. Okay. And Whoa, that looked dude. weird. Yep, it did. <laughs> It felt weird. I didn't like it that. felt weird and it looked. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, that's fine. I just have to keep hitting A. That's fine. Okay. Except in, in other circumstances where you definitely need to land and stop bouncing. <laughs> yeah, and A will send you to your death immediately. Yeah. What happened here? Did I open a door? Very fair. What uh, happened? Oh, oh, you can bounce on the. There's like ropes above you. Um. Oh, of course. It's all just brown bullshit. I know, it's horrible. Okay. Okay. Okay, does this help us? Okay. 
Do I dash? Yes. I guess. Yes. Yes. And out. Oh, do the zip zap! No! no! Why did the zip zap send me straight down? That was bullshit. That, oh my god. Okay. That was not your fault. No, it wasn't. Oh, god. Not in the slightest was that your fault. Oh my god, I hit the zip zap button. Fuck. Shut up, Sonic. What maniac designed this bullshit? Jesus. Is the, was the original Sonic creator at all involved with this? I don't. I doubt it. I don't know. Is that you, Suzuki? Uh, who who yeah, makes Sonic? Suzuki. Yeah. I think he probably. I think he probably was to a certain extent, right? At this point. I I hope. Or Yuji Naka. Yuji Naka. Yuji right. Naka. Yuji Naka. Yes. Oh, okay. What did Yu Suzuki do? Is he Shinmu? Yeah. Uh, yes. Okay. I, I hope that by, yeah, by this point yes. in, Man, in Sonic. Yuzuki uh, uh, was the Shinmu sure. guy, yes. Okay. And Virtual Fighter guy. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. I would hope that by this time in Sonic's waning, pathetic games, career, right. Yuji Naka was probably on a beach somewhere sipping a fruity cocktail <laughs> and yeah. not paying attention anymore. Does he still make games? Imagining, imagining Balan Wonderworld. Uh, oh, he made Balan Wonderworld, World. right. Yes. Oh, flick. I forgot about that. <laughs> okay, wait. Yeah. I need a zip zap. Wait, there... There's the zip zap just sends me straight down. Wait, 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 wait. There's a, there's a extra life nearby if you turn around. I mean, that sounds hard to get, and I had a good lineup no, there, wasn't. so I. There was like no stakes. You, you couldn't. I was scared, and death. I just wanted to move forward. Oh man. <laughs> I know it was probably dumb. Yeah, but it could. Do I need a zip zap I mean, on that? You, what, you what, know what? what if it's you die three more times, Dan? Okay. Yeah. I'm not. If he fails. And if you game die, over. I've if never you died. Three more times, we have to do all these levels again. I've never died. Stakes. I mean, I just like these guys get truly punished. What's happening? Oh, and it'll okay. fault. Oh, and jump, and jump. Don't say I don't have your best interest in jump. mind. Jump. I know it just seems scary. And I'm talking to the comments too. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Okay. I can do this all day. <laughs> Chat says Jess will remember this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What are we doing here? All right, maybe, maybe living, maybe dying. We'll find out. Just give me the end of the level. Is this level so long? It really is. What's happening? Remember like two or oh, three levels ago when there was like a jungle level and it just like, it was like 20 seconds long and it stopped? Yeah. Oh. How many checkpoints is this? It's I like don't know. It's what really, this is really not great. Okay. What's this? What's this? What's happening? Bop it. Pop the ball. I did. The wall. You're not popping the wall. Oh, the wall? The oh, fall down. of course. Okay. <laughs> You might fall down. Just, just. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I wish there was an extra life somewhere. <laughs> God, I need a break. Okay. <laughs> okay, go, Sonic. Go, Sonic. Go, 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 go. Okay. Keep jumping. Now what? What's maybe. happening? Okay. Oh, jeez. Yes. Okay. Okay. Now what? Is this going to fall? Yes. Maybe. Yeah, you should assume. You should just assume the bad things are going to happen to Sonic. I don't want to go <laughs> fast, though. It's scary. <laughs> don't want to go oh, fast. No. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's our, oh, no. Please don't do die. Do 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 I'm loving it. No, I'm not. This seems like an end, right? That looks Where like an end door. It? it has the end type of level vibes, yeah. Yeah, I'm getting that vibe. That it? seems like a big door. Can you trust this game? <laughs> no! It is the biggest door we've seen so far. No, big doors mean good things. All the other doors. Oh, God. It okay, give me a ring. Give me a ring! Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, it is! What's this? Is it? Okay, is it? please just be done. Please just be done. Oh. Usually there's a big cool thing. Cool thing. There's a big oh, thing. Oh shit, is it a mock speed zone? Oh my god, my hands are like Oh, vibrant. we're fucked. We're gonna be here forever. <laughs> oh, Wait, no, what? Is this, a, is this a mock speed section? No, 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 no. Or is it just a cutscene of like Eggman being like, ha ha, I have your girlfriend. What? Oh god! No! What do I do? That oh, one life is just really. Mm. Oh god. One life. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Do you know how bad I feel? Yes. Oh god. <laughs> I, I I can tell because it looks bad. It it's looks bad. Terrible. It looks really. Where am I going? Where's the what? Where the, what? There was nothing there. Why? That was nothing. He's Jesus. <laughs> oh god. 
Oh, the, you went underneath the one up. Oh, no my fucking, yes. fucking God. Just barely made it. Oh, 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 this feels like shit. <laughs> this feels so bad right now. <laughs> I feel like I barely Where have control they, of this fucking thing. Where do you go? I don't know. Oh. Ah! You, go, you go fast. Ah! <laughs> one last try. Oh, no. Gotta follow oh, yeah. that rainbow. Where's that Just one up? Wait. Don't think. Just do. Okay, turn brain off. Yep. Don't think. Uh. Don't think. Just go, 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 go. <sighs> where, where am I going? Okay. Oh, God. Oh, that sucks. <sighs> I hate this camera. It's it's unbelievably bad. <laughs> He's that is nothing. <laughs> when uh. he does that, that jump. <sighs> <sighs> okay. What? How? No, I got it. Whoa. <laughs> Oh no 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 no! Yes. This should end. This should be over already. We shouldn't have had to have done the last level. Oh God, Jesus! Have I been this far? Okay, I'm doing great. Doing great. Why is it like this? I support you. Okay, have I done? Oh. Is that it? Is that the end? Is that the end? Is that the end? Is that the end? Oh! Yes! Ah! Against all odds! Well, I gotta go do a celebration pee! <laughs> oh. Oh, Man, it sounds, what a it game! Sounds, it sounds like this when he pees. <laughs> I don't know if that goes through. Here, let me see if I have Oh my god! Get dang doodle! <laughs> yeah, I'll, just, I'll bring Dan in for, for, through this. Here we go. Here, oh. this is what Dan sounds like when he's peeing. Oh, you guys can't hear that. Oh, I can't hear it. I heard it's, dip it's dang like doodle. You know what? Here, here we go. Oh, hey, no, is there going to be a cutscene? He's not breaking the law. Wait, is he? <laughs> How's that make you feel, Chess? When I hear that one, I get Did a little frustrated. Agent 47 isn't breaking the law? Did I hear see, that? Dan, hey, Dan, I think Agent 47 is breaking the law. Agent 47 is not breaking the law. Wait, is he? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Bless that man. <sighs> Is that oh. going to be the dumbest thing you say today? I hope it is. Oh, oh I see man. evidence that the world is round. I'm not believing a damn thing. <laughs> you can't say that, Dan. Come on. Just oh, embarrassing to be on the show with you. Guy. What a fucking guy. This guy. Oh, what I miss. What is, it? is it an organ or is it just like a... What's a, happening? A no, wait. What am I? What have I not been saying? <laughs> oh, oh, hey. All right. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't Where like the out of context there? one. You you were talking twice, so that was weird. Oh, weird, huh? huh? <laughs> the engines are okay. And what's this? Man, the, the you say we will about this game, no. but the character models are splendid. Uh huh. Why is this happening? No, we're about to crash. <laughs> we're about to crash. <laughs> the game's about to. <laughs> I like air fortresses. I've always liked that in, in Sonic games. I don't, I don't want to know a person that don't like an air fortress, honestly. It's just Dan. a cool concept. It's fucking dope. Like Armada is also a good word. I like that. Mm, bad book, yeah. good word. Is that a, I bet that's a sci-fi book. It, it's a it's a sequel or prequel to Ready Player One? I don't know. Oh, it's by the really? Ready Player One guy. I saw that movie and that was dumb as fuck. Have you ever, Jesus. Have you ever read his poetry, Dan? Oh, no, I've never read any poetry. <laughs> It is absolutely Police! the thing I hate the most, and I'm here watching Sonic Coast 2. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I mean, I can't imagine how bad that book is. <laughs> no! What the fuck was that? My girlfriend! <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? It's Blaze the Cat and Silver the Hedgehog. Have we met Blaze the, ca the Cat? Briefly, in some other cutscene. I didn't know she was in this timeline, though. I'm really confused oh. why she's here. There are multiple Sonic timelines, Jesus. <laughs> if we return to an earlier point in time, we'll be able to save her. What's with the timing on these lines? <laughs> I don't even know if, like, in the original Japanese, they were timed out better or anything. <laughs> Iblis. You know, I've played those Genesis Sonic games a million times. I don't think I've ever gotten every Chaos Emerald. Me either. It's too hard. I'd have to save state. They're kind of tough games, honestly. 
There, you know, the like, later like levels? Those, those those bonus levels are, you know, no joke. Like you so kind of have to memorize some things about them. Myself. Especially the bullshit Besides, like first games one with the rotating go, right? thing where you always just fall into the goal thing before you Ooh, went to. It's hard. Yeah. I like the half pipe sure one too. The half pipe one's awesome, but I feel like you have to kind of know the placement of the rings a little bit sometimes. Yes. Yes. And then the uh, the Sonic Three and Knuckles Sphere one is uh, oh my god stre that stressful. me out so hard yes. as a kid. Uh, yeah. uh, fucking oh, I hate it. <laughs> the worst feeling is when you get caught between the like pinball bumper and like ding 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 ding. ding you know ding, it's just gonna ding, jettison ding. you into a red ball. <laughs> Haunts my nightmares that noise. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, fa I found the poem, but I'm gonna wait and make sure there's another cutscene. Oh I know, good. I know that good. that's important. Yes, I, this, this sounds good. I should probably save. Wow, I've gone back in time. I should destroy the people who made Sonic 06. <laughs> Is that the poem? <laughs> okay, I think I can save here. Oh, well, we gotta load first. I'll wait for Grub to get back to read this, actually. I'm trying to think if I have the read poetry, because yeah, some poetry can be long, like a book, right? I, I guess. I don't. I personally haven't. I mean, unless you're talking Dr. Seuss, in which case, yes. Um, <laughs> it's like what? a book. Uh, Is that iambic <laughs> pentameter? Is that what poems are written in? Sometimes. Not yeah. all the time. Is yeah. that just like a, the sing-songy, rhymey thing? Is that what's going on? No, no, that's like a Shakespearean, like, meter. Of, it's, it's like a... a it's like a tempo of some sort, if I, I guess I were to describe it. Hopefully, I'm not talking out my ass about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where the fuck am I going? Shakespeare's, like, really funny, actually. Like, if you actually understand what the fuck this old-ass, ye old <laughs> English guy is saying. Like, some really? of it's actually like, yo, that's fucking catty. <laughs> like, that's funny. <laughs> I don't think I've even seen any movies based on Shakespeare stuff. I mean, I know the names of, like, Macbeth you and Romeo and Juliet and all that. You probably have and don't know, because, like... Maybe? I don't know. Again, I, we have to show you Romeo plus Ju Juliet by Baz Luhrmann because it fucking slaps. I'm curious. I would check it out for sure. It is rolls. This, what the fuck? Oh, jeez. What is that? I thought you'd get something for doing that. What the hell? Yeah. Hey. It's just a fun thing to do. When the three sounds chime, the royal uh, family secret door will open. Okay, so I did that, one. That, Are these that. new? I, I, what, what, what do you mean these? Just the, the bells in general. I feel like I haven't seen those before. I feel like they were there, but they didn't let you go up there. And oh, like, okay, those that's... access points are new. They installed bouncy pads. <laughs> Just in case the prophecy needs to be fulfilled, here's these bouncy pads. I just think one of those would cost. Five thousand for hair. <laughs> okay, wait. There's a tall thing. That lady sounded like she was on fucking lose. <laughs> <Yes. or something. laughs> oh. uh, Soliana's king, and maybe I can get. <laughs> That's bad. Okay. Okay. I s please not in a specific order. Just tell me that bringing it's enough. Ding that thing. Yeah, okay. Two dings. What's happening? Can I, why can I be here? Scary. Okay. <laughs> why is I'm just surprised the game's letting me do this. All right. Uh, you, you've been here before, and it was similarly uh, scary and confusing. Yeah, it seems <laughs> like you shouldn't be okay, able can to. Okay, can you see the other, like, like I think so. Oh, yeah, I'm is that it? Wait, yeah. Are there dogs up here? Why is your dog up what? here? What? What the fuck? Is there a, what is with these people? I can't even talk to them. There's no explanation for what's <laughs> happening here. What is this little vignette here? What is happening? What There's no the hell. Oh, there is a door. Okay. All right. That is such a weird place to put NPCs. <laughs> what the hell? We'll just put them there, I guess. I've, I've never seen those people in my life. <laughs> it's weird as hell. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that looks great. That little, that little <laughs> yes. area. Doing a little dance in that crevice. Okay, here we go. This the last one? Yeah, I think this last one. In Soliata, we have balcony dogs. <laughs> is that the last one? Is that the same one? Or is that... Okay, so let's go over to that one. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, yeah, God. Fuck. Yep. Does that reset my bell progress? I don't know. <laughs> okay. I oh, think fuck. it might have. Oh, my God. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. Okay. It probably. I hope, I hope. I hope. On my deathbed, my dying sound is. Whoa! I don't know what death would get that out of a person. Like falling. <laughs> like if you slipped on a banana peel into a spike pit, probably. Yeah. That would do it. Because <laughs> okay, so we did that one. Okay, that one's done. Okay, just yeah, just keep going uh, clockwise, I guess. And see I want to be able can... to see. Okay, hmm. so we've done this red okay. one by the water. Hopefully, they're discernible by by that. Uh, yeah. Okay. Where, where does Found that the lead you? Okay. Okay. Is that a bell? 
Yeah, it looks like there might be a bell there. It, yeah. Is it inside? Ooh, look at this completionist. No, I think it's the one if you keep going further. But there's a star on it. Like That's like that's in there and that's like a level. That's the next oh, level. Why aren't they all stars then? I don't know. <laughs> okay. I don't know. <laughs> God. Anyway, Grub's not coming back for, for <laughs> wise reasons. <laughs> I'm going to read this Ready Player One poem in Please. his absence. Dedicated to Jeff Grub. <laughs> but yeah, Ready Player One guy, Ernest Klein. I don't know how old this poem was. It was on his website for the longest time, as if he was proud of it. It's <laughs> just the worst thing I've ever read. And I, I, I'll just read it to you first, and then I'm going to ask you what you think about it. Okay. <clears throat> Nerd porn auteur by Ernest Klein. Oh, oh Grub is back. Grub. Okay. Grub. I already hate it, by the way. Grub, here's a poem by Ernest Klein. Okay. The writer oh, of Ready Player wait, One. Not okay. This is not going to be okay, <laughs> but go ahead. Have you heard of it? <laughs> uh, I've heard, I've, I think I've heard some stuff before. I don't read it. I'm, I'm ready. Okay. I've braced myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, should I, should I add a little, like, a little echo? Yes, please. Too much echo. Yeah, little, uh, yeah make, make the room wet. Yeah. Test. Okay. Test. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a wet okay. reverb. That's a little bit. <laughs> it's actually a lot. <laughs> Maybe this. Oh. Nerd porn auteur. Oh, no. By Ernest Klein. Oh, no. <laughs> it's, it's too much. I'm turning it off. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've noticed that there don't seem to be any porno movies that are made for guys like me. All the porn I've come across was targeted at beer-swilling, sports bar-dwelling alpha males, men who like their women stupid and submissive, men who can only get it up for monosyllabic cock-hungry nymphos with gargantuan breasts and a three-word vocabulary. Adult oh, films, Ernest, please. Adult films are populated with these collagen-injected, liposuctioned women, many of whom have resorted to surgery and self-mutilation in an attempt to look the way they've been told oh to look. God. This is a poem? These, this is a poem. You can call it. You can call anything a poem, man. This is, this is the I secret. I guess. Like, this is the secret. He, it first published in the comments of Pornhub. <laughs> yes. <laughs> So like, here's my here's my theory. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop right here in the middle of this, right before he, he goes on. Maybe I'll come back to this. I don't fucking know. But here's my fucking theory. He's calling this poetry because it didn't get any laughs at a stand up open mic. This is supposed yeah, to be I'm funny it. originally. I think this is a stand up routine that flopped, and he represented it at like a beat poetry oh, slam, no. and people were like, okay. Does this guy I suck a lot? He fucking yes, I don't he know, sucks man. a I think lot. Sucks. Oh. Where the fuck am I anyway, going? okay. Sorry. Let's find out how much he sucks. He says these aren't real women; they're objects. <laughs> Is literally oh. the next line. <laughs> oh. These women, these movies aren't erotic; they're pathetic. These vacuum-headed fuck bunnies don't turn me on; they disgust me. And it's not that I'm against pornography. I mean, I'm a guy, and guy need, <laughs> guys need porn. That was the voice. Fact. <laughs> Uh, like a preacher needs pain, like a needle needs a vein. Guys need porn. That's the only uh, part that rhymes, and it's a quote from yeah. something else. I don't know what. Uh, a song, I assume. It's probably a Rush song, knowing this idiot. Um, <laughs> I don't want to watch this misogynist He-Man woman hater porn. I can't help but notice that he said a shitload of misogynist things in describing the porn. So, <laughs> Of course. <laughs> I don't want to watch this misogynist He-Man woman hater porn. I want porno movies that are made with guys like me in mind. Guys who know that the sexiest thing in the world is a woman who's smarter than you. You no. can have you can have the whole cheerleading squad. I want the girl in the tweed skirt and the horn rim glasses. How old was he when he wrote this? Too old. Uh, yeah, he was, was he like over 30. 14? Yes, he was over 14. Fuck. Yeah, he was in his 20s, yes. Okay. Uh... Is there more? <laughs> you know, you can there's tell more, a woman smarter more. than you is when she has horn, rim, horn, horn rimmed glasses. Like, go to fucking hell. Oh, <laughs> I want the girl in the tweed skirt and the horn rimmed glasses, Benny Finnebowski, the valedictorian. Oh, yes. First, I want to copy her trig homework. Then I want to make Fuck. mad, passionate love to her for hours and hours until she reluctantly asks if we can stop because she doesn't want to miss Battlestar Galactica. God Suma damn it. Summa cum laude, baby. That's what I call it. God erotic. damn it! 
but do you ever see that kind of woman in a contemporary adult film? No. Which is why I'm going to start writing and directing. This. Which is why I'm going to start writing and directing geek porno. Which, no. is, which is basically what play, Ready Player One is, except with no yeah. sex in it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I shall be the quintessential nerd porn auteur, and the women in my porno movies will be the kind that drive nerds like me mad with desire. Anyway, what fucking level is this? Was that? <laughs> is oh, is it over? Scene? No, it's not. It's Please like keep going. Over. I hate it so much. You got to keep going. It's like <laughs> half over. Keep. I got it. I got, we're all the way in. We got to do yeah, it. Well, listen, we, we, we've done this. We've made our dish dishwater. Uh, we have to soak in it now. Let's just do it. <laughs> I'll wait. I'll see if there's a cutscene first. Okay. I would hate to, inter to, to interlace these two bad tastes that go worse together. <laughs> yeah. I really hate that. Okay, Battleship's going to take off. Great. Okay. Okay, so we're going to end up switching I, I, Tails and Knuckles I have read this before. I forgot it is this what? bad. It is. What? So I think you might be able, I Dan, I think you might be able to uh, boogie through. Oh, or, like, like RT? Break dance through those, maybe? Okay. You either have to wait, which is hilarious, or you can do that, like, little, little, little break dance through. Okay. But anyway, I'm talking about the girls <laughs> that used to fuck up the grading curve. The girls in the Latin what? club and the National Honor Society. Chicks with weird clothes, braces, four eyes, and 4.0 GPAs. Brainy, articulate bookworms with Mensa cards in their purses and chips on their shoulders. Can we just stop? Like, I know everyone knows. I just want to say it. Can I just say it? It is so misogynistic to, like, to associate a woman's looks with how smart they are. Yes. Porn stars right. can be smart even if they look like whatever you're describing. Yes. Whatever bimbo you imagine in your head, they could be smart. He's this just a I think he... on such a fundamental level. Yes. <laughs> I think he just has like an explicit boner for Velma from Scooby Doo. Yes. Yeah, that's what just, I'm saying. Listen, go to town. Don't <laughs> get like you're better than these women. The fucking God, I hate him. Uh, go to town. <laughs> go to town. <laughs> Go yes, to town. Yeah, freak. <laughs> Go See, to town on Velma. <laughs> your, your impassioned speech just now was a better poem than this whole. Yeah, thing. thank you. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what is this? Stand up act, though. That's the problem. What are these oh, balls? Get a ring. Get a ring. Get a ring. Get a ring I'm, I'm get a trying. Ring. I'm in bouncy mode. Oh, I'm so scared. Fuck off. Oh, okay. Okay. My porn starlets will come in all shapes and sizes as long as they're nerdy, white, and skinny. Um, <laughs> <laughs> my porn starlets will come in all shapes and sizes. My porn starlets will be too busy working on their PhD to go to the gym. And my God, there's no way this guy knows what women actually look like when they're not, not going to the gym. <laughs> um, in my kind of porno movies, the girls wouldn't even have to get naked. They'd just take guys down to the rec room and beat them repeatedly at chess. And then talk to them for hours about Heisenberg's uncertainty principle oh or the underlying God. social metaphors in the Aliens movie. Uh, yeah, so what I'm the fuck is Alien sexual. a metaphor for? Oh, for fuck's sake. That's a different conversation, I guess. But yeah, sorry, go on. I'm not, I'm not going into that, okay. Uh, I, I oh, love boy. Alien. I didn't know it was a metaphor. Oh, All for right. fuck's sake, man. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We're moving on. We're moving on. Okay. Uh, we're going to focus on one moron at a time. Yeah. Here. Um, <laughs> okay. Fuck. Okay. 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 Can I walk on this? Uh, okay. Oh, what? Sorry. Go on. I think uh. it's Mercury. I think you can walk on that. I don't know. Um, okay. Uh, back to Ernest. Um, buy stock in some hand cream companies because there's about to be a major shortage. Ugh. And I'm... <laughs> and I'm not just talking about straight porn. Oh, no. There should be fuck films for my nerd brethren of all sexual right. orientations. This is, deck. This this is, is totally a stand-up This deck. is failed stand-up. Like, he yeah, re-jiggered re uh, it and called it a poem. It fucking ain't. Um... Uh -huh. Gay nerd porn with flicks, with gay porn flicks with titles like Dungeons and Drag Queen. Okay, yeah, that's, that's pretty good. That's the other <laughs> orientation. <laughs> Grub's coming around on it. <laughs> this artist is onto something. <laughs> This idea is a fucking gold mine. I am going to make millions because this country is full of database programmers and electronics engineers, and they aren't getting the love they so desperately need. And you can help. 
if you're an intelligent woman interested in breaking into the adult film industry, and if you can tell me the name of Luke Skywalker's home planet, then you are hired. This is the most like 101 nerd stuff. Like, yes, oh, name where Luke Skywalker's from. I don't think, Ready I don't know if you've noticed. the most 101 no nerd shit. I, oh my God. He is the nerd. most nerd 101 bullshit guy. Yes. Like, absolutely. He has a DeLorean. There's a picture oh, of Ernest Oh my, Klein of course he in, does. <laughs> there's a picture of Ernest Klein in a DeLorean with, with George R.R. R. Martin. And sure. George R.R. R. Martin looks like he would rather literally be dead than be sitting next to this nerd <laughs> in, in a DeLorean. And it's like, wants to stay home and watch football. And leave him it alone. Is, it, is the, fine. it is like one of my favorite funniest pictures uh, because he really just wants to like die. Like he he's <laughs> miserable. He's like, fuck it. Game of Thrones will never be completed. I just don't want to be in this car with this guy anymore. <laughs> <clears throat> what? But yeah, if you're an intelligent woman breaking into the adult film industry, and if you can tell me the name of Luke Skywalker's home planet, then you are hired. It doesn't matter if you think you're overweight or unattractive. It doesn't matter if you don't think you're beautiful. You are beautiful. And I will make you a star. Fuck. Oh, rip. I will make you a star. This and game the over. The grossest ways he could have ended that. And game over. The perfect time to game over. <laughs> is this man ninety-three percent? Is this man married? Believe it or fucking not yet. <laughs> I, wow! I, I, I'm trying to fact check it. I saw someone in chat say it's fake. I, I no, as it far is as not. I can tell, it was, it's real. It was yeah. on his official website. Yeah. Jesus Christ! Wow. I guess do I try? I'm just. Scan? I'm. I'm mm -hmm. like in, like I'm like kind of that stunned like. So the way the character feels after having his eyeballs opened and uh in uh a clockwork orange uh -huh. i feel like i'm in that right yeah now. yeah here's okay i'm not i don't mean to much. be like i don't mean to be researching people's personal lives or anything but i was curious so i was like am i remembering right that he's married yes he's married uh she has a wikipedia page too because she's also an american nonfiction writer and poet i bet she feels great about her husband <laughs> getting all the glory for writing fan fiction Fuck. um but uh, she married Ernest Klein, whom she met at the 1998 National Poetry Slam. I don't know when nerd porn Arthur was written. Oh. What, if, what if that's the meet cute? You, you made her a star. Jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. God damn it. That is unbelievably terrible. Yeah, like, that's a lot worse is, than oh, I no, expected. I expected right. bad. It, yes. <laughs> I, I don't know if I, if I tried to write something that terrible, I would struggle. Yeah, yeah, like as a parody, I like write, I write like shit. Like I write, I, but like I, I, I would, I would feel embarrassed trying to write something that, okay, that was I want, so that obviously that bad. I yeah. want. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna pitch something here, and you know, Dan, you're the creative director, so this is a good time. There's a good place, maybe, maybe a good place to pitch this. I want to do it out loud, just to just to see the vibe of the chat. Okay. Should we do a giant bomb poetry slam where we try to make really bad Ernest Klein ass like poems that don't rhyme, don't don't need to rhyme, but do make you want to die inside? I don't know if I'd be. I am so fine with looking like a damn fool. I am have no problem with it. There's some. I would want to die. I would want to die if I. I think I've never thought of this. I want to do it. The idea of this this sounds like my kryptonite. I think I. What the fuck? Did I just... Oh, everything just dropped out. I don't know if I'm still streaming or if Discord just crashed. Shit. Okay, Discord's restarting. You probably can hear me at home. Give me a second. Hang on. Uh, can you hear me? Hello. Yes. Okay? My Discord crashed at the very idea of me reading beat poetry. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, no. I, oh. Okay, I get I get I get the feedback. Okay. <laughs> are, we, are, are we I just want to make sure we're still uh, stream wise. Can you hear everyone? Can yes, you see everyone? Uh, everyone says that you were still you were still alive. Uh, yeah, my my OBS was fine. Um I, I would uh, want we, to we die. Need the, we need the, the sonic footage back though, by the way. Oh, yes, I need to beam it to you. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um <laughs> oh yeah, football. I would not be able to get through that. <laughs> There's no way. Like or, or if I even just had to read like bad, like if I had to read what you just read, I don't think I could get through it out loud. Yeah, it's real rough. It's bad. And it's not even like, I mean, it's one of his worst ones, but he's done more. <laughs> like, I hate pretentious stuff and I hate like nerd bait stuff. And like that is like the perfect. <laughs> somehow did both. Yeah. yeah, the Venn diagram is just crazy overlapping there. Oh, uh, man, that sucked. What the, what the mm -mm. fuck? Oh, okay. 
Woo, really, okay. It really makes you feel dead inside, doesn't it? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah but I mean, it fits with the theme of this stomach. game. Yeah. Yeah, you know. right. I'm glad you brought it here. This is where Yeah, this is the right ride. place. Yeah, it Absolutely. pairs well with the yeah. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, yes, I'm going to go yes, until my life. Yes. I'm, I'm either going to beat this level or I'm going to lose all my lives and, and then we'll call it. So we'll, we'll see I how just, this um, goes. I had to clean up uh, an accident involving human feces a little bit ago, and ah. that was not the worst thing that happened to me on this stream. <laughs> oh, my God. It was Ernest Klein. Oh, Tip kids? No, I don't How think How embarrassed so. would his kids be if he had kids? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. They would just, uh, just need to become, like, the total opposite of that guy just because they, you know, were so embarrassed. Like, the, I guarantee they're all Marines if... <laughs> If he had kids. <laughs> <laughs> They're all like Navy SEALs. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, boy. So so his wife has two two children. Oh, no, okay. he, he has two. Actually, oh. okay, Klein, who is married to so-and-so and has two daughters. Oh, yeah. no, daughters, too. Oh, boy. Oh, I don't know what's worse, actually. <laughs> yeah. God. His son is John that's, Cena. That's rough. That's rough. <laughs> Oh, Would it be rougher to be raised by Ernest Klein if you were a girl or a boy? Or an envy? That'd be that'd probably the worst one because he wouldn't I know what to do with the you. Girls would internalize it more. Uh, and the boys would become would have, horrific would have a much harder criminal time processing rapists. It. Like, yes, yeah. they, yes, they would like. Yes, they, they would be like rebelling in some real tough ways. Oh, oh yeah. boy. They're all. It's an all bad. Yeah. I remember that one time, Dan, that you pranked uh, the, the rest of the Beast cast or something by, like, pretending that you guys were expecting. Uh, like, Jason on, on Dancers. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. And, like, for a half a second, everyone was like, no. <laughs> I would have rather have that be true than Ernest yeah. Klein and uh, yeah. kids out in this world. Welcome what? to the sphere. Oh, God. Oh, God. Welcome oh, to the sphere. This also feels worse than it looks. Welcome to the sphere. What? What? Why did that bounce? What? Why is it doing any of this? Eat shit, what? video game. Welcome to the sphere. What was I supposed to do there? Oh my god. Okay. Guide your sphere. You put down the controller and walk away. Okay, okay. Go away, go away. Okay. And then. Fucking the jump. ominous. The ominous. Be careful not to fall from. Yeah. <laughs> from tails. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna bounce. You're gonna bounce. Where was I supposed to go? To the left. That was not a. That was not an exit. <laughs> well, I didn't, was there a door? No, there was more hallway to the oh, left. Oh, really? Oh, <laughs> fuck! Yeah. I didn't see it. I'm sorry, I, I saw it. <laughs> okay. Look out! You better oh, watch Oh, I see. Your I see. Ass. I see. I see. I see. Okay. <laughs> see, like from this angle, I can't see shit. No, oh, absolutely wait. not. Okay. And especially, it doesn't. Die, it's your own fault. <laughs> especially Ooh. like there's like some rings there. Oh no 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 no. Oh. no no no. Okay okay, you're doing great. You're doing I'm gonna do one at a time. No time limit here. Time is a great idea. Really showing off that PS3 technology with this yeah. foam orb here. Yeah. It's just Look. a just a JPEG stretched and distorted on this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that, that rules. Got to go oh, slow. What? What's happening? What's happening? What's what happening? Is why happening? is that? What? Why is he doing that? Why'd you bounce? You jump off it and Whatever. never go. Oh my God! What a video okay. game. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot how anything with tails works. Okay. Oh, there's an MP3 of Mr. Klein reading that poem. No! You need some more mental anguish for your day. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to make that a that. sound alert on my Twitch channel. <laughs> oh, man. Make it cost so much money. It would need to cost $1,000. Like $1, I don't let you go that yeah, high. Yeah, it, it's so long. Oh, my God. God. He's so impassioned in reading it, too. Like, I think oh, I've heard no. it before. And he's, like, he's really impassioned about it. Of course he is. Oh, this is good. Okay. Oh thing here okay 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 this is fine oh are there any rings are there any rings give me why does sonic just pop up what the fuck yeah okay <laughs> Did I see that yep do i just go over this what was that? i don't know <laughs> what what oh, what's no. this shit what oh, what's dear. happening okay 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 you're good you're good deal with some guys what is am i what I'm going to need like a Twitch clip of that, of Sonic just like popping. Appearing and oh, dying? there he is. What? Why is Sonic falling? I'm going to hang back. You do the hard work. Like, Good luck, Tails. Right? I'm not going to help. This sucks so bad. I'm taking a little me break. Okay. 
Why does it keep... Oh, right. It keeps making the ring sound when yeah, I throw that, but it's the same as taking damage, so I'm freaking out. Okay. Oh. And also, the rings aren't real. Yeah, it's just a great great decisions all around here. Yeah, just, just reminding the chat that that's why we can't pick up the rings, because oh, it's just, oh. you know... Exactly this game. Did Sonic just die again? <laughs> yeah. Whenever you have Sonic or Tails as a partner and you go over any gap, they never gap correctly so they they die every time even tails who can float awesome they didn't they didn't make it so that tails could like infinitely float if he's your partner which would make a little bit of sense so yeah. that he doesn't constantly go whoa and he's dying <laughs> okay hey we're doing it okay hey you're doing, doing the right, thing right. what there was a platform oh, when i came over here the there was a platform when i came oh. over here what the fuck? check the tape there was a platform <laughs> then there wasn't what? where did, did that see look at there it is did the camera get it's, caught on something? I don't know what happened there. What the hell? That's dumb as fuck. What do I have to? Oh my. What oh, do you have to kill these? Are How? you serious? What? What? How do you want me to do this video game? Can I? Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh no. What, what the fuck is wow. happening to the camera? Blah. Jesus. Holy shit, you lived. Holy shit. I can't tell you how bad this sucks. <laughs> what the fuck? There, there's, Are this you... can't be the, the intended way of doing this. Oh, there, that thing in the middle must be switched. Do you see that thing in the middle? Is that a switch? Can you hit that? Can that thing. Fly into it a that little thing's bit. weird, I think. It is weird. Is that a thing? But it doesn't. No, it's just a weird thing. Can you hit it with the, the rings? Just aim for uh, it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, oh, here. They don't seem to be shooting at me. Let's just take this opportunity. Yeah. Timestamps are done. Get Back. this motherfucker. Launching Sonic? Oh, you're, are you destroying oh. some of these horrendous balls? Oh, is that happening? <laughs> Did the, the door, door open behind you? No, it nope. didn't. What the fucking oh Christ? You know oh, what? You might, puzzle? you might be <laughs> like, you might be better off just trying to glitch through the door. Not okay. gonna lie. <laughs> it's sad that you're probably right. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Maybe you can just wiggle your dumb ass through that okay. door. I destroyed all Wait, of them. Is that it? Oh my god. What's shooting you now? What's shooting you? Who the fuck is that? What? That's Why are you there now? That guy. He was gone. No, he didn't respond, did he? What? He was, like, hidden is... he was hidden behind the what pillar. What is happening? Oh, okay. He's okay. hidden behind the pillar. <laughs> okay. Oh, yep. There, there he is. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Just That's bad. all right. It's a bad good. game. Yay! Give me a checkpoint. You can put him there. Oh my god. What? 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 No, 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 no. I don't want to do this. Where are the real rings? <laughs> I just, where's the switch? I just want to hit the switch. Uh, Is this a switch? I don't. Radical. <laughs> I... Radical. Okay. Let's Is that a around. switch? There's no bad guys. That's a switch. A... There's the I switch. So. There's Did, oh, see the ball? The ball. What? Okay. Did Sonic not say anything? I don't think so. Can I make that jump? He doesn't no, have comment. jump juice. Sonic doesn't have jump ball. juice. <laughs> okay. So now we. <laughs> What? Why is the camera doing that? Okay. Okay, there's the switch that you gotta get. Dang it! Dang it. Dang it! <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard Sonic the Hedgehog say dang it before. <laughs> dang it! You gotta whack the switches to turn them on! Okay, not that. These aren't timed, right? What they? the fuck? Whoa! I would love to hear Sonic curse, like actually uh, curse. Mm -hmm. Son of a bitch! Fuck you! Jesus wept! <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. Is that? Or, is that oh, that's where I came in. You that's, came from there? No, that's ball, what is that? I think that's Ball Town. No, you, you came up from upstairs, right? Are these fell down here? Yeah, but I think I... <laughs> <laughs> you were here earlier? Population you. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> where am I going? Wait, Why are guys. robots kill coming back? Guys. Kill all the guys. Oh, they, oh. they didn't come back. They didn't. They just didn't leave. You didn't kill them all. Oh, okay, we up here. Okay. Okay. Oh man. Okay. Lightheaded. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Look at those beautiful oh, majestic dolphins. No. What you forget it, Jake, you... it's fall town. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's a good one, Parada. Oh, before I forget, what is the metaphor for of alien? Other than aliens are scary and it would suck to be in space with an alien. <laughs> like that's a, that's a, all I read into that movie was like, man, that'd be scary as shit. Oh, is, so, was that a line in the poem? Yeah, it was. Okay. It was about like his symbolism and stuff with aliens. So I don't know if you 
noticed all the pregnancy and mother image that how the computer is called mother how all the doors yeah. are vaginal shaped and how oh. hr giger's design is very like psychosexual and stuff like that. it's basically the that. xenomorph is sexual yes how yes What's sexual yeah, about the we xenomorph? Got, we, got, uh, we got to show you a lot more horny you. horror, my man. Yeah. I love it's Alien, but I, what's the, sexual about eggs it? eggs in your gut through your mouth, and then it bursts out it's, it's, from... It's a, it's a rape demon, basically. Yes, and... Like, wow. it shoves its fucking... Like, it's got this horrific dick-like protrusion in in its mouth. It lays these eggs that that the the, 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 the hand version xenomorph right. like, goes down your fucking throat. Yeah, I just thought it was like eggs. bugs and stuff do weird stuff with laying eggs, and I thought they're like, what's and a then, freaky thing the and alien could do? And then explodes, like once it gestates, it explodes and destroys your body, just bursts out like a child might. You know, a child wrecks your body when you grow it in there. Fucking horrible shit happens to you internally and externally when you're pregnant. Now, here's um, my question. Was this intended by Ridley Scott, or yes. are these things that people have read into it? Well, okay, it's, Ridley I Scott mean, intends everything. Uh, he's one of those filmmakers that really does intend everything. Not every filmmaker does, but Ridley Scott does put meaning in every sort of choice he makes, and he should be called out for that. He, I mean, not that he, if you don't do that, you're somehow lesser, but he, he definitely does. Huh. Didn't he do I, Gladiator? It, you know, it, uh, yes. What yes, is absolutely. Gladiator about, like... <laughs> some some thing besides gladiators or like <laughs> yes usually i mean it's about it's about slavery and dignity and and what uh, i mean it's that one's not like trying to have like a, a okay hidden subtext. so i'm not missing some about... huge thing like i did with alien well like it's mostly just cool gladiator stuff right yeah i guess okay. i don't know <laughs> but the I, thing is, is that it's a totally different to type it. it's a, it's a totally different yes. type of movie you know like like right, gladiator is... you are almost inherently trying to Say something about humans by by using uh, things that are sub superhuman or subhuman, right? Like and, you're trying and, to and yeah. like horror movies are intending to disturb you, and yes. something that has been disturbing to many cultures over the course of human evolution is sex is freaky, uh, right. pregnancy is fucking freaky and scary too. Um, you know, like since time immemorial, like filmmakers and storytellers have been like combining sex and death together huh. to make you like kind of confused on a basic primal level like sex is attractive but it is kind of fucking weird and like the french call uh orgasm le petite mort which means the little death um <laughs> shit like that my man um yeah, I think a lot of these are like the tools in the tool bag for alien right where uh, he wants you to feel uncomfortable, so he uses this imagery, which is, yeah, it, it uh, sex does inherently make us pretty uncomfortable. And then when you um, focus on the wet, protruding, penetrating uh, aspects of it, it can feel alien in a way, especially and, and if it's not a welcome, uh, consensual thing. So absolutely, uh, wow. And like it go, you know, I'm looking at this like article here that has good examples, and it's like, you know, Dracula is a monster who sneaks into women's bedrooms and assaults yes. them in their sleep, and right, and you know, uh, and he puts a, a you know thrall on people and um, uses that to uh, take something from them, and that thing is is blood, but that is all. So the subtext there is also very sexual. And Always, like, I mean, obviously with vampires. Yes. Oh, vampires and blood. I didn't pick and that sex. up with vampires either. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. Oh my God, have you seen an interview with a vampire? No, but I love. Uh, I've no. read and love Bram Stoker's Dracula. Oh my dude, I got. I, I still haven't seen Bram Stoker's. It's, it's which awesome. Is tragic, which is tragic because I love, love, love hey, that costume that designer. Well, woman. It's the woman so fun. Costumes. It's, it's like, got some of the best. Amazing. I can't remember the name of the, the designer, but it has some of the best costumes and some of the best. Practical effects in anything ever made. I've been meaning to watch it forever. It's Gary really Oldman's fucking in cool. it too, right? I love that guy. Oh yeah, Gary Oldman is Dracula. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's excellent. Oh no! Scary, 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 scary. <laughs> hey, hey, that was that was a oh! zero, zero sum game. You just gotta, you just gotta up a one up. That's fine. Yeah, that's <laughs> okay, Dan, okay. I need you to stop at that first one and wait until it lets you through. I know you can just get the ring. I need you to stop and just wait. <laughs> is it killing you? <laughs> it's killing me a little bit. <laughs> Uh, I didn't even think about stopping. That's, I, <laughs> and what happens is you don't think about stopping. You run into it, and as soon as you run to it, run into it, it's the, the laser beams go away, stop running. and you could have just jumped through it. Stop oh, running. okay. Oh god, Dan, Dan oh. have you noticed how? Ooh. 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 Lucky boy, look at that. Go. Okay. 
Dan, have you noticed how phallic the little alien chestburster looks? <laughs> it's just a beepus. I guess, yeah. It's okay, just... Dan. that... I mean, yeah, yeah everything you're saying, nice. I get it. It's just that, like, while I've, I've seen Alien in the sequels numerous times, I've never once thought there was anything even did, remotely did you sexual about it. feel uncomfortable watching the alien uh, plant its eggs inside of John Hurt? Well, yeah, only in the way it's like, oh, that would suck having a bunch of aliens in me. Like, that's... that's <laughs> Yeah, having something, having something force itself on your face and put stuff inside you would suck. I mean, it doesn't What's matter up? if you're even thinking about it a lot of the times. It's still accomplishing what, what it wants to accomplish. Yeah, it's gross, yeah, it's, it's, for sure. It's, subcon it's subconsciously gross. You don't yes, have that, to, like... That's where it's, like, really effective yeah. in something like Alien. Okay, like, so maybe my brain to... knows it's a sex thing, but my conscious you brain feel doesn't. You watching that stuff, yeah. even if it is just it would suck to have that stuff inside me. It is working, okay. yes. Well, wow. Yeah, but film, like, you know, huh? it's, it's fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love film. I'm just, I'm just like, you know, when, when you, when you went to college for, for film, uh, did, did you take any, did you take any theory courses? No, I didn't take any classes, but like, oh. I don't even think I was supposed to take theory classes. I'd never what? even heard of that. <laughs> no. I, I, I mean, was not you're aware, I was, of, you're aware that he like never went to class. Yeah, I did not and, go to class. And, uh, ever. I, and like. Ever, ever, ever. And he just ever. talked his way into his grades. Like, yeah, you're, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I made a sketch comedy show, and I uh, the, you, the the film teacher liked me, and he just like he's like, I ah, sign up for all my classes, and I'll just give you A's. So, I, I straight up did not learn anything in college. I'm not kidding. I'm not saying that for a reaction. I came out of college dumber no, no, than I went in. Sure, yeah, yes. Man, 100%. charisma is not a dump stat for this man. <laughs> <laughs> I just made my what's dumb sketch modifier? show and skated through. What's, what's your modifier, man? This is ridiculous. You're breaking the whole game. All 20-sided die. Yep. Oh, my God. Yeah, so no, I, I technically have a film degree, but come on. Wow, that's wild and a half. Um, <laughs> we did have, we would have classes that I went to sometimes where it'd be like a Wednesday night class. It'd be like a three and a half hour course. And it'd be like pop half. culture of the 60s or pop culture of the 70s. And it's like, let's just watch Easy Rider tonight. And then we would Damn. watch it. But I skipped most of those too. So like, I haven't even like seen most of them. I would just before the test, like if I went to it, I would fucking look it up on IMDb and be like, who directed it? What are the themes? Uh, who starred in it? What year did it come out? And I so would you just know about like, themes, at least, in general. I mean, I could read it and be like, okay, this one's about war. And then, you know, this guy was in it. And then <laughs> I would just be able to deduce on the multiple choice somebody, test. Like, somebody edit the Gundam meme that says war is bad. And wow, hmm. uh, it's just like put Dan there with like the IMDB page protecting him. From <laughs> 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 wow, this is about war. Okay. <laughs> Fuck um, that. Okay. Whoa. Knuckles. This sucks. All right. Buckling around here. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Do um, you think if you did go to class, you would have learned anything? If I wanted to, but I never wanted. I wasn't at college to learn. I was there to get a degree, so places would hire me. Like that was the only yeah. reason I went, and I mean, for the I'm, fun, I, you know. I mean, I learned. I've learned a lot more by just doing jobs than I ever yes. would have learned in a class. That's the thing. True, All true. the time I spent yeah. fucking around in Adobe Premiere by myself and teaching myself how to use it and making my sketch show and stuff like that, right. and like that was or in writing video game reviews throughout all of college, mm. not for. Not for class, but doing it because I want to work in video games. Yeah, it's you know, true, like, true that. Like, you know, college is like kind of um, unnecessarily uh, hyped up as like the only way. Okay, there we go. The only way to get a job and stuff like yeah. that. Um, it's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a backward system in a, a lot of ways. A bit of a scam. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, yeah. it's a, a lot of places won't hire you if you don't have it. I remember yeah. Andy McNamara oh, was yeah, big sure. on like, you know, you had to have a college degree. And so it's like, all right, I'll play the game. I'll fucking get the degree. But like, it, it was never anything more than just getting I the mean, degree it, means mean, to an end, you know? To, to be to be fair, like you are scamming, you are scamming something that is innately a bit of a scam, which is smart. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah no, I, I mean, go, that, honestly, go yeah. to the go to the cheapest, most lax college, pop out shit out a degree. You yep. don't have to engage with anything, because I'm Homer Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I knew what I was doing the whole time. You know, I just like I, I don't know. I I never felt bad about it. I never. You know, I, I don't, I don't think, yeah, I really don't think you should, yeah. No. And I, people, even people chat, no one blames you. I, I can see it. Everyone's like, yeah, I mean, that's the system. Everyone understands it. So. Yeah, and it worked the way I wanted it to. So, like, I have, yeah, I would do know, it again. You know? I, uh, me. I did not go to college <laughs> and do not regret it even a little bit. It yeah, never not going. anything for me. Yeah. yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, See, it, like, it, I, went, I went to college, but it's because I was actually interested in like learning more stuff. So. Oh, I never I, considered I, that. Yeah. I enjoyed going to art school and like learning more about like the history of all of it, the craft, and you know, seeing a whole bunch of other people's like takes on this stuff and their art wow. styles and and approaches and stuff like that. So it was, and it was super formative for me socially. Like I was a oh, fucking anxious mess yes. before I went to college. Yeah, Holy right. fucking shit! That a thousand the percent. The most useful thing about college, and and I believe this wholeheartedly, is just being around actual like-minded people. A hundred percent. That's my uh, one of my favorite Richard Linklater movies. Is uh, everybody wants some, and it's a movie about starting college, and uh, they just party the like the whole first couple of weekends before class starts, and then the movie ends as soon as class starts, and he just lays his head down and goes to sleep, and like the implication is. The education started long before he went to class. Like sure. the education was having conversations with peers and trying to figure out like why people make decisions and why they behave certain ways and how you're supposed to behave around other people. And it was it's just a really good movie that really nails that uh, that whole concept. I just really appreciate it. Nice. Yeah. Oh, oh look, it's the end. Yay. <laughs> That was not a bad level. I mean, it was a bad level, but I mean, was, you know, <laughs> it's not a Sonic 06 worse. bad level. Could've it been could worse. have been way worse. <laughs> yes. Wow. I mean, like, I took a I took a class on horror movies, which those seats went quick. I got very lucky to get into that class because no it was a very problem. small class. It was only like 20, 30 people. Um, and it was awesome. And it was all about like how so many of these films are, you know, representative of the cultural fears of its time. Sure. And, like, oh, yeah. You know, immigration, gay stuff, divorce, <laughs> like it all goes through these different and like Alien came out in the 70s. There was a ton of like sex panic happening in this in, mm. in the late se late 70s, early 80s with like STDs and eventually right. AIDS. And like it stayed relevant uh, while throughout like sequels coming out and stuff like that. Um, I, you know, I don't think all, I'm the, totally... all the zombie movies were about were, were not about, but like they were related to people coming back from war and being different, being traumatized, oh, wow. being really? zombie like. Like that wouldn't be crazy to to assume. Of course, zombies as a concept predates the movies in like you know yeah. Creole folklore and stuff like I mean, that. This, this, this is always you're right. This is always like uh, even the bad ones, like the village, of 100% about uh, <laughs> society lying to its youth to protect them from. Uh, what the what the older people see as the horrors of the world or whatever, and uh, and, and like that, like especially a, a post 9/11 world where it's like, hey, we are not going to actually directly deal with these things. They're going to keep our children in a bubble away from all this stuff. It was speaking yeah. speaking of art. Let's watch this cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gross! This ship is about to crash. Too bad. You're very observant. <laughs> I like that this thing initially blew up just to make Sonic go back in time for no reason, because we could have had this same level anyway. Why did you it have to blow up? Way, so wait, he, he went back in time? Right. Yeah. Sure. Well. Oh, good. Start with the... I don't think... I, I don't feel like it... There's okay. a portal. <laughs> I don't think I'm incapable... If I went back in time, it would be all I would be talking about. <laughs> yes. It would be like I, Sonic's really no like selling it. Yeah, yeah no well, selling I mean, going back. I mean, in time. Sonic <laughs> Sonic has already gone back in time in the same game. He was in the far flung future, for, you know, the big city that was on fire, and that oh, tornado's right. carrying a car. Oh right, that's yeah. right. He went back in time from that moment too to fix that shit. That's right. All right, it's a boss fight. Don't collect don't all think... the rings, you fool! Stop it! Oh, Stop right, right. it! Do not collect all of them. I'm sorry to be mean. Do not I'm going to give myself rings. credit. Good call out. I don't think I'm incapable of dis of noticing metaphor because we recently watched Children of Men, and okay, that's I a, had that's the thought during one. it that like, ooh, this feels very post 9/11, like yeah. paranoia and stuff, like and government stuff, like. So I think I picked up on that. So yes, I mean, that that one, one, that's a that good one's, trainer one for that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that one's pretty. We're wearing its themes on its sleeve. Pretty, pretty good there. And we just watched and, Clockwork Orange and, the other oh, night. Where are and, you? Oh goodness. What? We just watched Clockwork Orange, and like I think that's about like, you know, reforming criminals. Like that's the metaphor for that. Is it's about, hey, can we make make a man good, or are we just trying to like, you know, I mean, that's make it so he doesn't plot. have a choice? Um. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, I'll take my wins where I can get them. Well, hey. <laughs> I understood the plot great. <laughs> nice try. That was the plot. Um. <laughs> so okay, I understand the plot. Is the plot a metaphor? 
You're the best. You're the best. Hey, we'll, 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 you know what? We'll give it to you. We'll give them that one. Thank you. Thanks, folks. Okay, Thanks, okay, folks. okay. I wanna. Can I assign you some homework if you haven't seen this one? What is it? Because this one's like babies for symbolism 101. Um, Annihilation. I saw the movie and I love it, but I What's don't it about? know. What's Do you know? Like crazy space, uh, other dimensional alien things. That's the plot. That's not right. the metaphor. I have no idea what the metaphor is supposed to be about. You might want to rewatch it with the idea in mind. We want to rewatch it. Mean, does this mean something? Like, that isn't just, like, what's literally going on. And not Mortal Kombat. Nature? The other one. Nature? No, 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 not quite. Metaphor is not nature? It's not. I mean, what would, What about nature? My just man? say, uh, yeah, no if we should take island. care of it? No. Is it like a fern gully situation? No. <laughs> I'm glad you got the, the fern gully propaganda. I never saw it. I just saw the uh, the trailers and it looked like it was a, hey, let's take care of nature movie. You remember the part where she fought Pepsi Man at the end? That was fun. Oh, yeah. I didn't know what the hell was going on. Like, I didn't, I have no idea what the fuck. Something? That one, I don't even really know the plot. I watched it and was very confused. Um, well, we should, we should really but I liked Annihilation. it. I just bought it on 4K. Hey, great. Is it on Prime? We'll do a watch along. Oh, Bonk and I are going to watch it. Bonk likes it a lot. Okay, well, when you when you watch it, I want you to think like besides the surface level stuff that's happening, what what's what's going on with the characters? What do they have in common? They're scared. Like, what is this? What what is potentially this a a, a play for? Like, okay, a symbol for. All right. And I'll give you a little hint. There is a character that has a monologue very explicitly about what the themes explicitly are, and it let me down because I thought the movie was really talking down to me. <laughs> oh, okay, gotcha. Didn't talk yeah, down didn't. enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> but then if, you go, if you go watch um, Annihilation Movie End Explained on YouTube, you will see that more people needed it to talk down even more. You know, because yeah, they... you know, absolutely. Like, I... I I admit that I'm a fucking snob. Uh, <laughs> I was raised on Silent Hill 2. What do you fucking want from me? I was I was 14. Is that metaphor? Have you played it? Yeah. It's scary. Oh, buddy. It's the metaphor. It would be scary to be in a haunted town. Because <laughs> I got that. I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Dan, you got it. Never mind. All right, cool. See, I'm not incapable. Yeah. How do I hang up? <laughs> Chat's, Chat's just enjoying this one. I, I, missed my, I missed my comic timing to actually legitimately hang up. <laughs> I, mean, I still enjoy these things even if I don't get them, you know? Yeah, yeah you can. Why. You absolutely can, but it's just, um, it, you know, I mean, it seems like I'm... I mean, it's, of course, it seems like I'm being a snob and talking down, but I think that the thing that ah. the thing that makes it hurt me is that I am here experiencing and enjoying an entirely a huge and important and deeply affecting element Ooh, of yeah, something. Yeah, we're watching different things, so that can be frustrating. And it went completely over someone else's head, and it's just like, oh, but you're missing what out the on the fuck best was part, that? Falling through the level. <laughs> it, what sucks is. The camera's oh, aiming no. up to like look at him, look at him, and of course something happens below you. That is just good game platform, design. Platform drop right out. There's no way to speed this fucking fight up. No man, fucking Sonic. Can't oh, go fast. This sucks. This sucks. I should be able to break that canopy. If the game worked right, I should be able to do things. I should be able to feel feelings, but I can't. <laughs> oh. Um, so yeah, that's, that's what makes me act perhaps more incredulous than people would like me to act when I hear things like this. Because like, oh my God, you're missing out on like the best part of it so for me. This this happens to me not with people missing out. God, fuck them. I don't care if people miss out. Oh, I, I get they, sad. <laughs> but when they post criticism, uh, oh, like, sure. oh, this show had a... Uh, an ending that didn't explain itself, and now no, we have to uh, try to imagine Fuck. what happened. And it's like, no, homie, if you would have paid attention to the themes and the metaphors, the ending is very clear. The, my example for this I always go to is um, Fargo Inception. Fargo Season 3. Oh, Inception's go. a good one, absolutely. Fargo <laughs> Season 3, where the entire, the villain is not a real villain. He is a metaphor for the predatory lending markets and uh, the financial system that preys on people and individuals. And he's a manifestation of that. And so when they have their sit down at the end of the season where it is the person trying to uh, bring some, bring this, this system to account, this person that represents the system of predatory lending to account. And then they have this, the showdown where like, 
I'm gonna call the cops on you, and they're gonna come take you away, bad evil man. And he's like, are they? And then the show ends. And you could say, well, they never showed us what happens, but we know what happens because we live in reality where no one ever came to punish those people. So it's, it was always a commentary on that. If you read the themes, you would very easily be able to get this. And it was just very frustrating to read that in a lot of reviews where people, oh, they just didn't understand what they were even watching. A, a lot of people sure. are not creative in that way. And it's in, you know, if, if you're not like kind of geared toward that or if your education doesn't foster that, you're never going to like learn it overnight, right? So, yeah, you know, it's, right. it's, it's, it's mostly like, just right. sad, you know, it's just like, oh, that that stinks that you don't get to have this more fulfilling uh, relationship with this media because you just haven't been trained to read it that way. But yeah, I think, and I, like, I don't want to make it about like judging individuals. It, no, yeah. It, it, it's, it's more right. It's sad that I, oh, it's fewer people to have conversations with, uh, fewer people to, win, to enjoy the kinds of things that maybe I enjoy. And, and because we live in under capitalism, that has some ramifications on how popular these things can be. Uh, and so I, I might get less of it. That's the kind of stuff I worry about. But and yeah, like, it's like, you know, people just some yeah. people just like it, like written out for them. And, and who am I to judge? Yeah, like I feel I feel bad that I I seem to be judging people for this stuff. I don't mean to seriously do that yeah. i come off that way because i'm a brash sounding person <laughs> i'd like to think i'm not judging people i'm just being like oh man that stinks like can't can't you you know wouldn't it be great if you you, you understood that a bit more and then there usually isn't a actual curiosity to poke and prod that metaphor more it's and try to get some to more stuff too, out. right like it's like yeah. it has to be validated in uh like oh i did read it this way did you too <laughs> and then when there are people like no and i don't I have no interest in doing it it's like oh am i am i the weird one i can feel that right way yeah so, i'm gonna try I mean, this i mean like a lot of people are like oh god Whoa, okay. that was scary. That was. That's what you're supposed to do. Man. Well, he is like 50 yards over a chasm. Yeah. <laughs> That's very oh. scary. Holy shit. That was cool as hell. <laughs> I, yeah, I think if I, you know, maybe I don't have the, the skill points in the, like, understanding that type of stuff, but, like, maybe I have super skill points in, like, deeply appreciating, like, The Rock. Like the movie, yes, you know, it oh, works. Yeah. Like, like I, mean, I right. there, think that kicks both. ass on on a level yes. that I think some people don't aren't on that same oh, level. Yeah, with that, like know? I mean, I think I think a lot of people think that like, oh, this person's a snob; they can't be related to. They must not like other cool things that really don't seem to have much meaning to them. It's just like, wouldn't it be fucking cool if this shit happened? And it's like, no, it is cool that this shit happens. I like a lot of bad movies. <laughs> You know, they rule. Not everything has to mean something. Yeah, and it's, uh, you can find meaning whatever you want. So if you want to look into the rock and find stuff, you can. But you can also just appreciate that it's um, a spectacle and there is value yes. in that. And uh, Yeah, I love a spectacle. Absolutely. Yes. And, you know? That being said, and, uh, uh, I haven't seen the rock, so maybe there's a lot of symbolism that Dan has... I, it's all... It wears it all on its... On its oh, sleeve. symbolism? Oh, I don't know if there's any symbolism in the rock. It's like... Hey, nerve gas I mean, would suck, I bad. guess. Whenever there's a prison in something, you should be on the lookout for a little bit of symbolism, just in case. I don't yeah, know. I, mean, I don't know if this has it. Tiny <laughs> bits about like the way like the system maybe uses prisoners and stuff. And like, the military. Yeah, all, the military yeah. using the military, yeah. Other, yes, but yes, that is all super oh tense. That is, be careful. You got, about one, that you got one hit left. He's I, got one oh, hit I know. left. I'm aware. This is uh, dramatic stuff here. And I have no rings. And no camera control. And no... Platforms to stand on. I was oh, trying no. to say, people would bring this uh, to video games a little bit more, because uh, I think I think we got we got real hung up on prestige games that look expensive, and uh, and so that's where tastes have gone. Yeah. And I'm like, actually, there's a lot of value in dumb games. Oh yeah, we should have like, a lot more dumb games. There's also so much value in indie games, like holy yeah. shit, oh, zero budget oh, games. Oh, 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 get out. Oh. Damn, dude. Now that's that a degree haver. Yes! <laughs> College! <laughs> <laughs> what is that dumbass eject? <laughs> oh my god. Look at See ya! Fucker. What? <laughs> Hands Bye behind his. <laughs> Hell yeah, that's a cool dude. Yeah. That is a cool dude. <laughs> you beat! Ejecting the from Sonic your airport. episode. <laughs> this game kicks ass. <laughs> Whoa, did you just say that? Uh, that part was that. You know what? I'll remember the last thing I saw, and that was pretty cool. Yes. Well, <sighs> well, Jesus. The last thing might not, might, you know, who knows? Who knows what's next? <laughs> I beat it. Ass uh, rank. I wouldn't say that. <laughs> yes.
<laughs> oh, uh, they had low standards for that fight. What the hell? Uh, oh, I well, beat the game. I beat everything, every piece of content in this game. I'm getting a jalapeno pretzel from sheets as a celebration for what just happened. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, wow. Good time. Backlar says you'd literally need one accessory to dress as Eggman for Halloween. <laughs> I just read that, too. Yeah, just, is funny. the accessory just getting fatter? <laughs> I think it's just the, the, the glasses, right? They're oh, uh, glasses. Yeah. yeah, I got sunglasses. I can do that. <laughs> I'd have to shave the beard, though. Okay, do we just watch the end cutscene here, I guess? I suppose so. End cutscene. Mm-hmm. Oh, badass rendition of his world. Fuck yeah. You know what game has zero symbolism? This one. Okay, I'm not missing anything here. Nah. <laughs> okay. Does Metal Gear have symbolism? Oh, you motherfucker. Don't fuck with me, Dan. I'm yeah, not I kidding. I know, I know now no. that it has politics, but I didn't no, just have symbolism. Do not fuck with me, Dan. You are fucking with me. I'm not fucking Som with you. Sometimes it... I think I cannot tell when people are fucking with me, and sometimes I think I'm like, uh, I got something wrong with my brain. Case. And this if you had like, the gun no, to my head, no. tell me what's the metaphor for Metal Gear, I guess I would just say nukes. Is that... <laughs> you can't... Okay, when I say a metaphor, you can't just say one word. It has okay. to be a sentence. It has to be something saying uh, also something. Also about uh, free will and uh, genetics so, and your, your family lineage. Are these the metaphors? They're themes. They're not oh. metaphors or symbols. I thought I was getting somewhere. <laughs> we got we to gotta work on your vocabulary. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I think I think you, you you lack the right words for the right things. Anyway, they're laughing, they're having fun. Great great game. <laughs> well, nice. You want to make out? <laughs> Ew, he winked. It's just like oh, his forehead skin goes down to his blow his nose. That was gross. Well. Do they? Do we have to load the kiss? What? No, I thought they kissed. Play, you have to play more of the game to get the reward. Lacey Chabert yeah, with Princess kissing. Elise? Weird. Okay. Well, that's credits. That's Many Sonic the Hedgehog this. 2006, folks. No. We all Putting learned a little bit. Characters. We all had some good times here with Sonic no. the Hedgehog. Jess Stop and Jeff, it. thank you for joining me for the entirety of this classic. Uh, boy, what a ride, folks. We're going to see honor. it through. You're going to finish it. You're going to finish it, man. You better not complain at all when Bubsy 3D oh. happens. <laughs> Maddie Blaustein well, is listen, the voice I'm going to complain of, a lot. Of, okay. Maddie Blaustein was the voice of the robot, of course, which you did. You hardly even got to see that dang robot because guess what? There's a lot of game left. Oh, we'll see what happens next week. Uh, okay. Well, is there anything afterwards here or is this it? I don't know. Well, here, maybe we've got a time really, during the credits. Explain what is the metaphor really I'm missing with Metal Gear? I don't what, know where to it, start, man. I don't know where to start. Wait, well, if you were to say, like, there's what is the metaphor many. of Metal Gear? You, there's you, too I, many. The, the question there is, like, what is the theme of Metal Gear? But there are Nips. there are also then a lot of metaphors used as tools to accomplish that. Um, uh, there is a lot. Um, but it's also, he's also a very sort of spray and pray with his metaphors. Sure, okay. Uh, Ko Kojima. Got it. So it's, like, hard to, like, pick out one good example. I, uh... I don't want to actually have this conversation, but I want to make it clear that I just had the thought, does Evangelion have metaphors? No, you did not. Shut I did just have that up. thought, and no, I know that's probably a no, much larger no, conversation. No. You know why? You know why? I know you're lying. I know you're lying. Uh, no, we did a whole podcast, because, and we watched it, and no, we talked about it in the end, and, and, because, and his intention and all that. Because I recall, because I listened to that podcast, Dan, my man, before I worked here, <laughs> I recall you and Bach saying stuff about themes of like motherhood and being th that should be important. Oh how, yeah, because like, the, the, the mom robot, turned into a robot. Yeah, the robot was like womb like with the with oh, all yeah. the fluids. Yeah, you yeah, yeah. That. So here's the thing. Here's that what might be symbol. happening. That was here's a what for. Here's you what might know be happening. About it. That podcast was recorded right after we watched all of it. So that was probably fresh in my mind. We're having a conversation about it. So in my mind now, years later, I think I think that I didn't know that, but I obviously did back then. <laughs> I think it's just the slate gets wiped after like there's like a 90-day period and everything's wiped, you know? 
<laughs> but like, wasn't it like uh, that's not rewarding? Unusual. I'm, I'm like a struggling to remember specific examples of metaphors in stuff that I love. So yeah, it's, well, it is. It is like a little bit more nebulous of these things. So yeah, well, like, give, give me some credit. You like you, you, you caught that one. Like you know, yeah, it's not you, like you I know how to do it. If I had you just know. watched Evangelion and then came in here and said, "Oh, I didn't know there's metaphors," that's one thing. But I think I actually just forgot what it was about. Yeah, you know whole, what I mean? There's a whole episode chapter called Oral Stage. That is true, Chad. Oh, um, yeah. But yeah. like, you, you know, like, it's there. You recognized it. You know, yeah. that's a yeah. big deal. Like, yeah. I know? wonder if I'm a genius while I'm taking things in, but then I instantly forget and then I think I'm a dumbass <laughs> like, about it. So maybe Metal Gear, I'm understanding every like, Metal Gear as I play it. Well, no, I'm uh -huh. sure Metal Gear scan it's like probably a, pretty clear I wasn't. <laughs> do you think, like, didn't it feel like rewarding to be like, oh, like, is this that? Like, it's no. like a little secret. It's like a little prize. You figured something, like a little puzzle that you figured out, right? I guess like, I've oh, never had that feeling, stuff? no. Is this no. mom stuff? Oh, no? I don't think I don't, so. I don't feel like it's a puzzle. I don't like that. That makes me like, it's, it, that makes me feel like the Da Vinci Code where no, someone yeah, left the prize I, behind for it. And I'm like, nah, and I also, this, it's more about internalizing it yourself, right? Yeah, and I also don't mean to like, uh, imply that Eva is sneaky about that stuff. <laughs> sure. Um, but it's there. You, you saw it. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just explaining very, like, I, I'm trying to get across an element that I enjoy about it. I'm not saying that all themes are puzzles. Please stop <laughs> listening to me wrong, everybody on the internet, please. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe I just forget a lot of stuff. <laughs> Wave Master? Anyways. Sonic is a metaphor for imperialism, and here's why. Three-hour video today. <laughs> uh, if you guys want want to read more about what I think about metaphors, I did a whole thing explaining what I think the witness is really about, which oh, is uh, lines. Really, uh, what was it? Yeah, huge. Yeah, it's about lines. <laughs> uh, huge waste of time. But I did write that. I think it's still up on GameSpeed. So uh, I, I have never side-eyed a piece of content in a video game more than like I was loving the hell out of the witness, doing all those puzzles, just like oh, logic stuff. But this is fun. I'm solving all these puzzles. Those. I felt great about like when I, those are puzzles that I beat and I'm like yes I'm smart and then I walked past one of those recordings that was just saying a bunch of stuff and I stopped for a while and I yeah. listened to it and I was like what is this shit <laughs> what does well, he think yeah, he's I being know, deep he, about he, here this is you know not everybody right, who so, writes is good at writing <laughs> right. you know right, even so though those, they got videos, an air about him <laughs> yeah those videos were uh, I think self-criticism they're self-criticism I think so like, they, it was him trying to explain a way he thought at one point in his life and he's actually a little bit embarrassed about it now so uh, it's you watch, self -satire? Like, the videos, they, uh, not no. self satire no self it's a, a, a you know self reflection okay man this is good this is good pop punk yeah his world <laughs> this is one of the slappinest songs in sonic guys <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh god, we got a breakdown here. Yeah. It's the early odds. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. These lyrics. Fucking A, man. Fuck yeah. There was a oh. time in our life where oh, everything was Linkin Park, and it was better. <laughs> and it ruled. <laughs> it was cool as hell. <sighs> All right. I have saved the video game. A hundred percent. Nothing else you can do. Uh, can you yeah, can write you... on your uh, control stick I'd love for me? Oh, for that. Yeah. Man, the battery just died. Shit. Um, <laughs> uh, fuck. All right. Uh, we'll see what happens next week. <laughs> Everyone, thanks so much for uh, for watching Sonic uh, 06. Jess and Jeff, thank you so much. We made some Absolutely. great progress here. Bye. I, I love this I really feature. Don't say, Please read, connect controller. <laughs> <sighs>